two teams competing against each other and each team has four members. One person asks a question and the facts get less and less obscure as they go to the end of the question. First team to buzz and get it right wins, well not wins, gets the point and gets a bonus. And you can get either 15 or 10 points on a toss up and anywhere from 10 to 30 points or zero on a bonus. I think Quiz Bowl is awesome because it sort of covers all sorts of topics and um, I learn a lot from it too, but also I can recommend resources to kids. There are actually lots of resources online that are like study resources for Quiz Bowl. There are like frequency lists of like what topics come up most often. But really my philosophy is like, if we can just have fun practices at school where they're just doing the trivia, then that's where they're gonna learn the most. Name this painting in which a person stands near a railing on a hill overlooking Oslo Harbor holding their hands to their head and opening their mouth to let out the title expression of the horror. Screen. <laughs> the screen. The screen. Yes. <laughs> when I'm in my classes and I learn something interesting, I think of how it could be like used in a quiz bowl question. Of Arna. The great way? That is correct. Yay. That is like you need to be able to confer with your teammates so that you can like work together well as a team. You also need to be like willing to study and like listen to the questions and like remember them so that you can get them in the future. Just today we had a thing where they were the one team had a bonus question that was something they had just learned in science and they couldn't believe that the other team didn't remember that word or whatever it was. So yeah, it's great to hear. I like it because a lot of these things I learned by reading or in class. And it's just like a way to put that into action and you get like the adrenaline and rush of an actual like, sports game, but it's not the same as sitting in class and reading a book.